Chapter 8. Yep, the final chapter. Foxy, we've had you uh, on tender hooks this entire time, and you're about to find out the shocking truth behind Shadow of Memory. Oh, shit. (laughs) And the girl. Sorry, I should clarify. One of the possible hidden truths behind Mm. Shadow of Memory. Yeah, so I haven't been here for the last couple of episodes, obviously. Um, so where, where, how far have we gone? Well, we've been there. You, you were here last time for you us. You were here last uh, time. Was I? Yeah. Was yes. I? Yeah. Yes. To be fair, our last session was like before Christmas, so it has been a while. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. Okay. Thanks for making yeah. the date, uh, Dennis. <laughs> I'm a very fucking busy man, Foxy. I know that. Yeah. Aren't we all? Aren't we all exactly in this economy? <laughs> But yes, so um, the last time we left it, we found out that uh, of one of the people trying to kill us, being there. Uh... Oh, yeah. Yeah. So now we are at the stage of seeing, well, there's actually a mastermind that play behind the whole thing. And that's who the real killer is. That's a big carrot. It's a huge carrot, isn't it? They really didn't get the proportions right in this. Somebody going to eat a singular carrot. I'm not going to eat a single carrot. Do you need a single carrot? I mean, I've gone with good intentions to, like, you know, have a carrot eat raw. I've always taken one bite of it and just gone, Bleh. Yeah. Like, unless I do like, you know, carrot sticks with some hummus or something. Mm. Basically, I'll he- eat healthy things, but only if they're covered in unhealthy things. <laughs> <laughs> Give me something that's deep fried and smothered in chocolate. Yeah. I... I <laughs> Like I'll I'll devour a deep fried carrot. <laughs> like, <laughs> so I just want to say like a very strange request. But can you can you dip that carrot in chocolate? Yeah. Yes. Yes. The turnip as well. Yeah. The chocolate yeah. turnip. Yeah. 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 Just pour the chocolate all over. Listen, yeah. ladies, this body doesn't just come around. You have to work. <laughs> I devour my vegetables in chocolate. Yeah. Would you like some chocolate broccoli? <laughs> I call it the bullfit diet. Remember bullfit. Bullfit? Yeah. Yeah. Do you not do you not remember Bullfit? I don't think so. Remind me does. Oh Bulldency, oh yeah. Bullfit, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Sorry, I was thinking of some actual fucking lampoon and there I was thinking, oh yeah, I forgot wrestling gimmicks. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot I forgot one of my friends. Hang on. <laughs> Poor Bulldency. Yeah, he was fine. But yes, so um, so at this stage of the game, our main character remembers that she that he left a waitress in the 16th century, and not only does he go back to try and find her, he waits four years. I should have to be person. fair. I cannot tell you the amount of times I've done that. Well, you left. I think in the 16th century. hand on heart, who here can say that you've never, ever, just brought somebody back and left them in the 16th century by accident? I mean, I can't. No, you're lying. Right. You're fucking lying. Okay, well, you tell us the story then, alright? But let's go fucking finally on the record. I now. was there. I was there with you when it happened. No, you weren't. I was. No, I changed the timeline. You weren't there. We, we went to Token. No. You played that fortune that fortune teller machine. Yes. That granted your wishes. You wished to go back to the 16th century. I didn't I didn't wish for anyone to go back to the 16th century. Kira hasn't been seen since. Kira's right over In the 16th century, I told you! <laughs> It was, was you. Right she was. She was right there. <laughs> Fuck you in your timelines. For anybody who didn't, the hand just come into frame, just like bang. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm I'm slightly impressed that I've managed to integrate both the timeline of Shadow of Memories and the movie Big. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's it's a very much a more. <laughs> more idea really you know some say shadow memories exist in all universes at the same time look at that rendering on that ivy fuck yeah (laughs) see she's fine four years Dennis she's grand she's integrated that's the point (laughs) 
She shouldn't have to integrate. We should have just I came back for five minutes afterwards. I was worried about where you were. There's literally no she narrative reason for this. It barred the fact that she the said that's all us so. She was only pretty shook up. She wasn't. Why is her yeah, eyes so okay. fucking yellow? I'm really is she a yellow-eyed demon now? This. No, she's she's in CP. Liver, yeah. She just died the character into CP. Liver damage. <laughs> 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 yeah, she's really set settled in there, alright, yeah. Yeah, she's definitely integrated. She's so forgiving of the simple fact that he's been gone like four years. <laughs> she's so understanding. She's like, ah, you know, I just assumed that, you know, you'd be back sometime. And you weren't! <laughs> now I've got syphilis! I looked for you for a long time, you know. This is where voice acting, like I'm a sorry. good voice acting, would have really been helpful. Too, but I didn't have any luck. Yeah, as opposed to everyone just sounding like mildly yeah, polite. No I looked for you time. too. The town's tiny. And you didn't, huh? by the way. <laughs> oh, yeah, it took you six chapters to have him fucking think about it, you dozy cunt. Well, I don't know. Mature, come to think of it. <laughs> I should specify, I played this game oh, now twice really. for two different channels. I fucking hate this main character so much. <laughs> you can actually see me, as the sessions go through, you'll see my hatred for this long-legged freak continue over the over the past, because my god. I've had to play this now, like, two Look, she's times. grateful! I've done there a lot of go. different things. How is that? Is it possible for someone to gaslight themselves? Because that's what's happening here. Like, Ike's not even saying a word. Like, you can't even blame him on the gaslighting. He is just stupid. I, I, I get what they were going for. Joking aside, I get what they were going for. They were like, oh, she was so miserable in her current existence, just being a waitress or whatever. She went back here, she found a place, and she's much happier in what she's doing. I get what they were doing. They just failed miserably at conveying that. Yes. It, well, a lot of it is the dialogue as well. And you can, get, you can understand if it's been from, translated from Japanese to English and whatever. Like, yeah, well, you know. yeah. But, but like I said, they, they act, like a lot of the scenes... They only actually make sense, like, Why did you like uh, in kayfabe. They only make sense like five minutes later when you understand you know why she's so sure. comfortable yeah. want this time. Like, and that, and again, you only realize that if you follow the certain ending path, which is even weirder because then there might be some endings where we just don't, we just don't care about it whatsoever. Yeah, <laughs> which is so, even just okay. baffling. I have no one she's explaining here, Foxy. I don't know if you saw, but she she doesn't actually want to go back with you. Yeah, 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 like she's no parents, no family. No like, yeah, she she wants to stay here. No one expected hmm. anything of me back there. Now again, so because we we made a decision a while ago to uh, basically imply that Margaret was our ancestor, um, and that basically locks us in to a certain number of endings, and those endings do not include Dana whatsoever. So when we do get yeah. to later endings. Um, and then we will be following on this plot thread, but I'm as of right now, this is just dropped. This is the end of Dana's story. I feel like I've come so, home which honestly, like, uh, That's how right acting and dialogue home. aside, I actually do so like please, the premise of this as a, as a, as a, as an ending, because it's, I've uh, already made up my mind. I won't say unexpected, because it is expected, mm. but it, it's just a nice story, like, you know, oh, it's a nice ending, this? saying... She was miserable. Now uh -huh. she's happy. The red stone mm. from that day. You know, uh, and and she gets she gets her happy ending, even if it is a bit that fucked up. A... Yeah, it's a bit. It's all, all kinds of paradoxes will be caused by it. <laughs> Again, I also laugh that she's had like this red, beautiful red gemstone in her possession for four years, right around the corner from an alchemist who would literally kill her his own family. <laughs> They I've get it, and they just never met. Them. They never met. <laughs> They've never yeah. seen each other. Like, this town is tiny. Like, this, there's so few people here. Like, how could you not I see this see woman at some point in four years? But, but considering yeah. the guy is such a shut-in, that Thanks, kind of checks out. I'm willing to give them a pass on that. Like, what are you gonna uh, Yeah, I'll give him a pass for that, because it is implied that he's essentially a fucking hermit, I... that they never see him. <laughs> Hermits, yeah, <laughs> exactly. And, like, they did explain <laughs> that does check out. There's someone you know that I work with? At the manor house where I'm being looked after, he and I, well, we're going, we're to, going start to start a life together someday. someday. So, <sighs> so I'm going to be staying. So I'm going to be staying I'm here. Really I'm really sorry, Ike. Won't you regret it? <laughs> so no, actually, I'm no, sorry. I won't. <laughs> I love the way he goes. 
Okay. He goes, you will regret this. <laughs> Damn you! <laughs> Thanks. No, my narrative. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, but, but I'm the hero. No. Whatever he did there, right? You know, he did that motion. <laughs> Because of your blurred background, it like it's... censored your hand. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't censor that, but it fucking censors the motion. <laughs> Inappropriate gestures is okay, but waving your hand around is <laughs> censor's job. Wonderful. So we've got the stone. We got the stone. So now we can give that to the alchemist and. Uh... Get this ball rolling on the finale. The finale. Mm. Just a matter of me trying to find the fucking alchemist's house first. <laughs> hey, look, it's, it's not a massive town. Map. Yeah. And yet you still can't find things. Yeah, it's it's just because everything looks the same. That's the thing. Like you, there's a few things you can pick out, and then <laughs> oh, now I know where I am. That goes back really, to what I, was I, just I, said. The fact that like, uh, how did you not come across each other? It's like. It's a small town, but no one can find each other. I feel really no cruel because for some reason it just popped into my head. I was just kind of like looking for something to talk about. And I was just saying, oh, that's Scrapper Mania. You know what we do? And I was like, Foxy's got to have wrapped it again. We'll just go drink it again without. You did come to see him, not Margaret, didn't you? Oh, Foxy had to work. Sorry, Foxy. No. And he still are you vaping work. or are you eating? It's kind of bueno. Oh, right. <laughs> Unless he's vaping hazelnut. Uh, <laughs> um, imagine my surprise in the middle of a conversation with Joe the other day. He whips out a vape and he starts. <laughs> what the fuck did you start vaping? You, you this fucking when did you join the twenty twenty first century? <laughs> um, is this it? Yeah, sorry, Foxy. <laughs> That's the only stone I know that fits the bill. No, we'll send you pictures again. <laughs> that was that was quite fun the last one. In fairness, right now. It's all right. It doesn't matter if this is not the true stone. I'm grateful for your help, regardless. But if it is, I think so. Now the other thing we're not we're not quite as convenient this time, but we'll uh, we'll make it come back again in let's see five. No, make it ten days. So yeah, this is also something that's kind of fait accompli as well in okay. most endings, that is that I essentially let the alchemist have have his way and let the accident oh. happen. What is it? So that's also that where the um dangerous. one of the key kind of plot points that is that like be, for the most part this this, is something this accident does do. happen. Something and it's because of like essentially because you uh, give I, him I, I would like to hear Foxy. Mm -hmm. Do you have any theories? By then the on, on who the mastermind may be, because both me and Jonathan know. I would be able to show in fairness, we left. We did ask. We did ask him to steal this point. Um, yeah, last yeah, yeah. So, yeah let's so let's let's let's, let's, let's shake him for life. answers. Maybe it's a bit too early into this, I but you know. What they say last Atlanta. time? Because uh, I know you, you had a bit of a think, and then you you said you kind of you had to, to think some more. See you in ten well, you did. Well, we did. We did. We've already let out that it was. Um, could you keep this uh, not wrong from Hugo his... and Margaret? The guy from the library, I can't remember his name. Uh, no, no, no. fucking. Anyway, if the guy that's this, been running the library slash museum like, is the guy who's been actually trying to kill us, but he's not the one that's been. That's yeah, making it, all the it, machinations. He's answering to somebody else, yes. Yes. He can't seem to face his mother's death. I, I wouldn't be surprised if it's some weird fucking twist Should where it's the young boy. Succeed? Just because okay. he seems to be very, uh, to find Hugo. Yeah. I can in my quest for he just seems to not like you at all. It's a fair guess. Oh, I mean, to be fair, it, you could literally guess any of the main characters now, and it would be a fair guess. Mm. So it, it's a fair guess. Yeah. I can see where you're coming Take from. Mm. He seems really fascinated by us, is what I'd say. Yeah. Just to kind of support your point there. He's fascinated, but pissed off because, like, stuff didn't go his way. Exactly, yeah. He's, a, he's an angry young man. Yes. Mm. Oh, can't speak of the devil. Speak of the devil, it goes right to him. <laughs> hey, he is always like, Have you been here this whole time? <laughs> uh -huh. Yes. What is Fucking it? children of the corn. His voice really annoys me. Damn, what's the matter yeah. with father anyway? He hasn't let me into his laboratory. Because you're a little shit. Look at those eyes. When I went in there the yeah. other day, he got really How can you not be suspicious me? of him? And ever since... There's some secret in there he can't tell me about. I mean, I, I for one personally, I don't trust any child that speaks like this. 
Like, he should be the fucking the hall monitor from advanced, Rascals. You know, with tools from the future and stuff? Of course not. Nothing like that. Really? I'd definitely ask for your help if I were father. Then I think I could the Rascals is an elite through time. Like the one you showed me before? I sort of understand how it works. <laughs> it's like, wow. is it, but I, again, he must be a might annoying prick, but this guy, look, this well, kid's a genius if you can understand it. Of. Uh, he can kind of reverse engineer a time machine after seeing it once. Working on right now. <laughs> like, you basically see, the man sees, like, an iPad, and he I'm goes, sure I can make a time machine out of that. So it's like, days. considering it's, uh, it's indicated it's not even fucking man made, I'm really impressed, <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I have something to tell you, Father. I'm going to start another experiment, but this one will I be... I haven't dangerous. appreciated as well how small that so man's head is. Two to leave the house He's tiny. Him. It's a small head. Right away? Yeah, alchemists. Yeah. He does. The sooner the like, I know, and it, it's, it's solely because, like, the, 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 the cowl and the, the robes make, his, make him look white. Else. So yeah. it's it's thrown it off, like, but, like, just when, the, when you see the proportions the from a distance, it's like... You little small. shit, he no. just told you to leave the house. Shut the fuck up and get out. <laughs> He's just like, I don't love you. I never loved you. <laughs> <laughs> like this is just feeding his fucking contempt for you and oh, for, Pete's. for everything. Everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Doing? This is the this is the chip on his shoulder. What age is he meant to be? If she's oh, meant to be like sixty. She's meant to be a uh twenty one she... apparently. Oh, is she twenty one? So you're just gonna apparently. do it? I think do at this point choice? he's supposed to be fifteen. I think but, yeah but okay it's only for a little like, she's a good few years older but like we still get ready. wait so where am i getting the 16 I from is that when he first met her yes of course yes okay i am sorry we're always in ah because it's four years now okay see you soon mm. okay yeah so she's uh 16 when they meet first so at this stage from the four years skip then would be 20. She, she's an adult now okay And Hugo is meant to be 12 when we meet him first, and 16 here. Yeah. So, so I knew I was remembering that right, because... Yeah, like... no, it's not the right idea, lads. <laughs> I am the Terminator. <laughs> da -dun 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 -dun. I terminate. It doesn't, same, it doesn't have the same intimidation factor. <laughs> I, uh, you know, I, re I really need your clothes and your your boots. Actually, don't no, forget about it. I just I just want to ask. <laughs> if anything, he's the one that gets mugged off by the Terminator. <laughs> you see my legs. Look at his legs. This is so he's so long. <laughs> his legs are full of legs. Your leg and your he's got, leg. He's got two sets of legs. I choose to believe that. There's no way one full length of leg is that long. Maybe Why are you like... so selfish? <laughs> all you had to do was tag me. <laughs> <laughs> you all you had to do was tag me. That's lads. That net. We, he's he's got it. Hello, you know, Dennis. Here? We might have the car in the back now. He's got to get in it. He got it what? straight away. I don't know how he got it. Margaret, Hugo. The true mastermind of this piece Anyone is Owen Hart. He was all along. Oh, no, no, no. It was Vince. It's a perfect time to have him pull down the foot. No. It was me, Foxy! <laughs> it was me. Ike all screwed along. Ike. This beer here, <laughs> is this a time machine? Look uh, well, at that. Beautiful be. time machine there. But that sounded like Margaret's voice just now. What do you mean it can't be? Literally fucked up shit is happening all over the place. <laughs> is it me wrong? That's impossible. <laughs> I'm never wrong. I'm Ike. It's the most elaborate interface and the cheapest looking interface at the same time I've yeah. ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, just, it's, just, it's, a, it's a take on a printing press, pretty much. Is it? It's, it's, yeah, well, I think it's supposed to be. But it's not. I, I see it as like weird corridors looking things, and then. Uh, yeah. Well, I'm, yeah, I'm thinking basically. more from the numbers being looking like the actual old printing blocks that they would have had it for. Uh, oh, yeah. That's, that's the way I'm looking at it. 
That's really fuck. But why would that be a time machine? That's really fucking weird. There's actually no yeah. reason for a time machine. Like there's no, there's no, there's nothing. There's no quantum physics involved in that. It's just like I, I want to put in some numbers. That's great. That means I think. Is this Hugo? You ready for the twist, Foxy? I really like these machines of the future. By Jove, he did get it right. Project your voice a long distance. That's really something. Hugo's in the present. Yes. How do you know my number? And he found, found out how to use phones. I asked someone called Eckert. That's his yeah, name, Eckert. So now, you can, now you can hear his how voice all the time. Why? Yeah. Yeah, oh, great. <laughs> Were you the one threatening Mr. Eckert? Come on. Threaten sounds so serious. All I Fuck. did was propose. You're gonna have to stop that. Your 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 voice acting is so much better than the game. <laughs> You're showing it up. <laughs> You're emoting, you fool. Stop emoting. It's pretty simple, really. See, I would love to do this. Like, okay, can you just say that he just said he just made his own time machine? Yeah. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Actually, I didn't make it. Not exactly. The Hugo of the future completed it. <laughs> A transport, a transport mechanism, mechanism to time space. So that was literally his life's work was making the time machine like to chase after us. Actually, I think the, other the stuff perfect crime. Hard, but mm. cares, right? any, to be honest, it would be. But, like, hate is a what big about, fucking motivator, apparently. Mm. But it has a whole life's work just to get back at us. For We're essentially not doing much, really. Well that, well, that is the argument. Should, could we have done more? Should we have given the stone to the alchemists whatsoever? Are we, the, I say, are we at fault for our own misdeeds? Which is kind of the point of most of these endings, in fairness. Hey! Just expecting the, the cut to like someone just run up behind him like, STAB! Yeah. <laughs> like, just Eckert gets him one more time. You're It'd be on the so phone much more entertaining. Like It'd be so much more entertaining if people actually said the word stab when they stabbed. <laughs> You've been stabbed. Kind of <laughs> stab! 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 You can only stab as fast as you can say it. Hey! I got <laughs> my stabbing. Ah! <laughs> yeah! So we have to meet in the town square at this hour of night. At the market plots. Market plots, yes. It's a very elegant language, German. Imagine if we were to Hugo. read all this. Where are we you? would what generally kind of see <coughs> <the> voice messages. <coughs> Lord, you're so noisy. I'm here, right here. Who's messaging me? So you're gonna try and kill your sister? Yeah. <laughs> Isn't this so fucking weird? It's like, yeah, see, get it. Yes, we met him before. Hiding in plain sight. Hugo. Yeah, he was the kid who said fire to the pulp. The Bear in mind to kill me. that Ike, going back to Never the 16th century, Where should have recognized him by now, you but apparently not because everything was in fucking sepia. How could you not tell? The homunculus was completed because you showed up. I need to, um... Creating the homunculus. Isn't that right? I read Father's research notes... Because this is funny with no context. I, I need yeah. to send you both uh, Get your father to create the last message that I, I sent to uh, to Road Wife. Okay. Um, As she will forever be known. <laughs> yes. It isn't. With zero context. Mm hmm. Okay. What I really wanted was to get here earlier and stop what you were doing. But all my yeah, machine no. could do is follow yours. So I targeted yesterday's you because I thought I could manage to get to you before you did the things you did today. I had so many chances, <laughs> but I still didn't manage to kill you off. <laughs> <laughs> it's a oh, shame, that's brilliant. There's no way for my machine to that is brilliant. Yours. I'm not going to give context because I think context ruins it. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I agree. I think oh, yeah. that's in the trying to guess what the context is. <laughs> What's with his eyes being like fucking silver? Being it, it's it, you know what? I think he's a replicant. Destroyed. Like if you told me he just came that's off the set of Blade Runner, I believe you. To get a hold of yeah. Philosopher's Stone. Philosopher's Stone? 
What use is that to you? Gee whiz, I did you not read a book about alchemy not you fucking two hours ago? Explain all this. Revenge, get it? Homunculus destroyed my family, and you're, you're the oh, one who revenge. had him created. Are you getting uh, this now, Foxy? He, yeah. He, Hugo. So I Hugo's blaming him true. for the creation of Homunculus. I just mm -hmm. didn't yes. seem like someone who would do a thing like that. So when we there got the initial explainer on alchemy, the basically did. the Philosopher's Stone Come is on, designed to do one of two Let's things, right? The two things time. that these, these great alchemists can do together. with this stone. One is to create a creature called the Homunculus, no. which is apparently can live whatever, whatever, like whatever the caveat that is. The second one is that it can create an elixir of life, which can basically heal all potential diseases the, the alchemists back stone. then decided to make a homunculus to replace the mother that they they had recently it, lost as opposed to the elixir of life but save. she died would too quickly probably saved her that? would have saved her but she died anyway she died I like years to to uh to uh to for that so so homunculus was the only other uh solution and of course he ends up making the homunculus and so, we, yeah. we see who it is so now Hugo is attempting to get Homunculus to somehow get the Philosopher's Stone back out of Homunculus to bring his mother back to life. Exactly. Basically make the other choice that his father didn't make. Precisely. Yeah. And this is where all of our diverging endings begin. So what we've done here, I played through this is I, this is the game, uh, the full game playthrough as it is with path A, let's say path number one, which is is Margaret our ancestor, yes or no? If we think she is, that locks out endings relating to Dana. So all the endings we're going to see here now are all related to the the Wagners, let's say, or to that, that family, and then then come. Uh, the, end, the ending of those conclusions, we'll switch over now and see what happens to the other side. In order to get the actual, in order to get the actual EX endings, the final endings, if you will, we had to get all of these endings to begin with. Now they're the ones I'm really interested in because I have not seen. I've not seen them. Yes, exactly. No. I've seen the rest, but I have not seen the. Are they true endings or are they just secret? You would argue. Well, see, I think this game is supposed to position that like any of them could be the true ending. All right, there's no true. Okay, okay. No true ending. But it depends on your it depends on your interpretation because if basically I'm asking, is it like a an, an actual ending or is it like fucking Silent Hill? The dog who was in charge of everything. Possibly. Yeah, they're not comedy endings anyway. Let's well, I, kill I, Hugo. I, I like, I like, I like, I like the. <laughs> He's gonna dodge and stab. 